Ladies and gentlemen, it is time to react to the brand new zombies map, Firebase Z. I There's really not much else to say. I'm just going to be reacting to the trailer and we're going to see what this new map is all about. I am super pumped. We are getting it going right now in 3, 2, 1, start. Let's see what Firebase Z Wait is. Up. I'm still in the field. I have to meet a contact. I am not proud of everything I have done, but I am proud of what I am doing. Omega must be stopped, no matter the personal cost to people like you and I. No, my friend. They are the ones who are going to pay. They have already opened their new worlds. Ravanov. My team has reached the village. Requiem. Welcome to Vietnam. We have to get out of here now. I don't know what to say. This is... This is interesting. On the move. Oh, Lordy Lou. What is that thing? Pick up the pace if I were you, for Max's sake. What is that? That's a very... These are all legitimate questions, man. There's turrets, it seems like. Yep. Oh, that was a sentry gun. Yeah. Ooh! New wonder weapon. Oh, that looks like a sick wonder weapon, man. That's a you. Tombstone. Jesus. Are there two new bosses in this map? Okay, so that's that. Uh, interesting. Uh, I have no idea really what to say to that. I mean, now I'm just going to mute it because I've already listened to the whole thing. Uh, just to, like go to these certain spots. Uh, so you spawn in here. Uh, that seems all cool. This looks like uh, one of the missions from... This looks like one of the missions from... What's it called? Uh, the campaign. I'm being dumb. Uh, looks like the second mission where you go to Vietnam. That might be what it is. I would not be surprised if that is, in fact, the case. Uh, that guy, I don't know who on earth he is. Uh, but... Nothing, I mean, nothing there. I mean, you got that portal, which sends you to a completely different part of the map. I don't know if you can go back. That's clearly a Dark Ether portal, but... I mean, this doesn't look Dark Ether at all. So, maybe that's just a portal that... That, maybe that's just a teleportation portal, not a dark ether portal. I mean, that's what it looked like, because it looks mechanical there. The ones in D Machine were not, they were natural portals. They were not, um, they were not mechanical portals. So that's probably what that is going to be. Uh, you hop in there, and then you come to this area of the map, which I don't know why. At first, I thought it was Nuketown. This is clearly not Nuketown. Just at first glimpse, I got, I saw Nuketown, but no, this is clearly not Nuketown. I don't. I think this is brand new. It looks like its own layout. It doesn't look like anything. That's yeah. Okay, that's Tombstone. I was gonna say this part is my mouse being shown. Yes, it is. Um, that that perk down there looked a little bit like Mule Kick for a second, but no, that's that's clearly Tombstone. You have an arrow, so this is where you're gonna get the power, because you have all these arrows uh, going that way. Uh, you go over there. I mean, let's, I'm, I'm just trying to, like, this guy looks interesting. Let me back up so I can get a better, a better uh, view of him. That, okay, so, I don't really, I don't know what that really is. I mean, it's clearly one of the new boss zombies. It looks like the height of the Megaton, maybe a little bigger. Um, but that's clearly the boss zombie that we're going to have. He looks like he's going to be more annoying. He looks like he's going to be faster uh, and all that. I think he's going to be more annoying than the Megaton. That's just going to be a prediction I'm going to make. That guy's going to be more, a whole lot more annoying. I assume this is the power room. Maybe that's not the case, but it looks like the power room. If, if any room would be the power room, it would be this one. <laughs> it, I feel like it has to be. I don't know what that all means. 
uh, moving forward, uh, you got, I mean, it doesn't really look like you have that much space to train. Uh, we'll see when we get into the actual map. But that, that was, that's one of the things, oh, the new one that went, but I'll get into this in a bit. But one of the, one of the things about Demon Machine A I didn't like was that it was a very, very easy map. The map is insanely easy. All you gotta do is, like, you take your, you take your starting gun, you upgrade it a bit, or you get a weapon from the box, whatever you wanna do, and you just go to spawn, or you go to the lake, uh, or the pond, or you go to the plane wing, and you just train, and then boom, you're good. And the Megaton's quite easy to deal, quite easy to deal with. Especially if you have the right weapon. So, I mean, uh, that's that's one of my issues. And also, the um, the uh, DIE machine was also... Uh, it wasn't an amazing Wonder Weapon, but it definitely was, like, a good Wonder Weapon. Uh, but against, like, the Megaton, it didn't really do much. This looks to be a mix between the DIE and an actual, like, assault rifle. Like, you clearly have two modes. Like, you have you have this mode right here, which shoots that. And then you can there's a there's a switch that you can uh, and now it acts like an AR it has its own scope, uh, which is cool. And then that which acts like uh, the what's it called? What is the thing called? I've completely forgotten what the thing was called. Um, it's in Moon. It's the monkeys in Moon, not the monkey enemies. Like the monkey grenades in Moon. They're not monkeys, but that's the equivalent to the monkey. I forget what they're called. I completely forget what they're called. It's a thing that summons a black hole and sucks zombies into it. That's what that looks like. But instead of sucking zombies into it, it just explodes and kills any zombie in the in the radius. Uh, you have that right there, which looks interesting. You have... I, I don't know if that's necessarily fast travel or or something, but that is clearly a... a that's clearly a... Um, it's a launch pad. Which is going to be uh, fun. I want to look at this Tombstone machine. Because we all know Tombstone was coming. We, we knew it. They've already revealed it. I just want to look at the machine. And I want to like compare the two. Here, hang on real quick. I'll be right back. So I've just put... I'm, I have just literally put these two machines side by side. Just so that we can see the differences between the two. So there's clearly massive differences <laughs> between the two. And obviously this is perk bottles. This is perk sodas. So that's that's obviously going to be different, but I think the new one looks much better. I mean, I think like all the new ones look better. I I prefer the old speak hole personally. Uh, the new dead shot looks insane, but uh, that's cool. Uh, anything else besides tombstone and all that? That was a napalm. That that was a napalm uh, strike. They they revealed that 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 right there. That's a napalm. They already revealed that that's coming to zombies uh, on February fourth. So actually, I want to look because there's a little bit of purple in the background there. That might just be, like, back here. I, I don't know if that's anything special. That might just be, like, that part of the map. Um, but I don't know. This looks weird. Uh, it, it, it's a, it looks like a cool map. I, I, don't get me wrong. This look, That also looks like a new boss. That fires that. That looks like a mix between the Megaton and Brutus. Uh, but maybe not. I don't know. And I don't know if that's a boss. Maybe, maybe that's the final boss to the Easter egg. That's what that could be. That looks Dark Ether-like. Like that beam that this guy's shooting. This beam, it looks like it's Dark Ether. This might be a Dark Ether entity that we have to um, that we have to kill. Like maybe this is the thing. Maybe this is the thing in D-Machine. Uh, if you get to round 40 and then go into the Dark Ether, maybe this, uh, you see that thing? Maybe this is what was brought back when you're doing this easter egg maybe you have to kill this thing and that's the thing that you saw in the forest maybe i don't know i'm just sort of spitballing ideas and then we have this actually this is important i want to listen to this again if you lie to me if you betrayed her if any harm comes to her i will kill you myself so that's what's interesting uh, in terms of story this guy is a new character i don't think we've ever seen before maybe we have seen him before i honestly can't i honestly don't know but uh clearly weaver was speaking there he was speaking to this guy saying if you harm her i will kill you her is samantha maxis i think that's quite obvious uh they've already i can't remember what it was revealed in but there was uh it's already been revealed that this map is essentially you going to outpost 25 Outpost 25, yes, okay, I'm not being dumb. You go into Outpost 25, 
uh, and saving Maxis because she was captured by by uh, Omega. So this guy might be an Omega guy. I mean, what does he sound like? I forgot because you do you do hear his name. Oh uh, no, no, you don't hear his name, but you do hear him speak right here. Welcome to Vietnam. Yeah, he is not American. That was clearly not American. I'm not very good at accents, uh, but that sounded that sounded Russian. That's that's somewhat sounded like Russian. I think this guy is a part of Omega, and I, I, I'm maybe I'm completely wrong. But I mean, he's he's clearly beat up, but he he seems perfectly fine with being beat up. This guy's tough. He can definitely take a hit because I mean, you you see, he has a he has a broken arm. I'd imagine. Um, he has a bunch of blood stains all over him. He's clearly not doing the best. And I think, maybe I'm wrong, but right here, this top part, I think that might be a, a complete cut in his shoulder that he's just running with. So this guy is clearly tough. He can take a hit. So he's, I don't think this guy is afraid of anything. I think this guy might be the antagonist of the map. Uh, but maybe I'm completely wrong. Maybe this guy is going to be the antagonist of the entire storyline. And this is just where he popped up. My, oh, yeah, you can see right here. Uh, that's, uh, that's a Soviet Union. Uh, that's Soviet Union right there. So this guy is definitely Soviet. Uh, it's just, that's going to be interesting to see what this guy, uh, who, who, what role this guy plays in the storyline. Uh, I'd imagine Weaver saying if you hurt her in any way, I assume this guy captured Samantha and now he's interrogating her, uh, through torture. That that's this, that's gonna be my guess. Uh, this guy is works for Omega. Uh, his team managed to capture some, Samantha, and now they're interrogating her, or they're torturing her to try to get some information out of her. Uh, and Weaver clearly does not like this guy. He clearly does not like this guy. So that's that should be my guess. But that was my reaction to the trailer. Uh, and yeah. That's pretty much this video lasted a whole lot longer than I expected it to, but I like that. That was good. Uh, it, it was a little, it was a little slow going in the beginning. I just didn't know what to what to say because nothing was really. I wasn't. We weren't really getting much information about the map. But now we have information about the new Wonder Weapon. Uh, two new bosses, maybe three new bosses, uh, a brand new character, uh, and a brand new map coming in one week. As um, the date this was uploaded, it will be a week. Yeah, so that's going to be it. Uh, see you guys all later. Goodbye.